I'm taking out a guided fossil walk today along the Jurassic Coast and we're meeting up with Mike Harrison oh, on the beach that. who's going to show us some rocks. The colour of that. It's not at a really good angle. Really bad angle. All I can do is sit in there and open the yeah. place, really. And I, I don't think you're going to get it to cleave through at that rate. But... I don't think either. No, look, there he goes. Yeah. The quali um, quality's there, you can see that ammonite on the edge. I've got a chisel with me, maybe I can... Yeah, I think you can chisel it. And uh, Gina's got a chisel as well, I think. Well, the lady on my fossil walk today is out to see the right fossil-bearing rocks, but this stone, I've never seen the likes of much before. A stone, though. Yeah. Gina's got uh, a chisel if you need it. Oh, you got one, excellent. One of the special ones. Specially angled chisel. I don't know how good it would be on this one. Ah, I don't know what to do to be honest. I wonder if I should try and get it split that way. I should do really, shouldn't I? Yeah. I'm just in, just in there with the chisel. Just yeah. that, right, right in there going in, that, that way. Well, this limestone rock should split like slate, but seldom have I seen uh, such an so, awkward rock. So slippery, with the, uh... Maybe hit it, I think it hit it there. there to get a flat face. Yeah, yeah. There's a flat face. <laughs> that's more like it. I put the big ammo on top of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's the way to do it, isn't it? With, uh... Give it more of a punch. One of those real uh, seriously, savage. What? Seriously, what's the matter with it? They're in there. They're Rolls. in there, packed, aren't they? But it's, it's, it's the way the woods mocked it up. Yeah, nice little, uh, nice little edge there. That's the edge to start on, isn't it? That's going to send it through. I hope so. It's got to. Finally. Come here then, before you open it. Oh, Ready for the grand opening. There's no promises though, you know. There might just be a piece <laughs> of wood. There might be some nice little ammonites there. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh! You can see the wood, the lump there. Running through the back of the stone. So the wood's just under the, just under the stone layer there. Interesting lump there, actually, isn't there? Is there? Yeah, see, look at that oh, lump. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's odd. Although there's a bit of a bump the other side of the stone there. There. Yeah, yeah, that's Big... the wood, isn't it? That's oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's, so, that's a bump there. But that's there. not wood there. No, that's a bumper. That's got to be... What should we do? Just break that across there? Yeah, get right a flat there. face. Uh, yeah. but... Uh. Oh, where's the fossil? Oh, the no. quality's there, isn't it? If, it? if you get one, but yeah, sure. This is a really picky, picky. Oh, oh, Lovely white ammo. 
Wow, I don't know, because hey, does it look there is a there is actually a bit of a line there. Do you see that line? There is there. Yeah, and it's running through to that prop there. I, 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 yeah, that's the, some, there is something in that uh, bump area there. It's, it's funny how it scooped that out there. Yeah. There's a dip there though. What's that's, that about? Was that the wood, where the wood was? Where the wood was running? Yeah, I guess so. Maybe it was an asty just off the wood. I reckon there might be a, a fossil in there. Just in the bump. I reckon it might that be. That relief. Should I see if I can pop it? Yeah, that'd be amazing. Jaggedy edge though. Yeah. Though. It's quite soft as well. It's not it's not nah. doing what it should, I don't get it. Um the whole of the rock's been like that, hasn't it? It's a bit of a pig, isn't it? Why is that? Doesn't help when you miss. Totally mucked that up, didn't I? Just not doing anything. All it's doing. It's a nice problem there, and that other bit of the stone. Lovely. Ah, there's a bit, there's of, a a zip, bit of a zip. But that's a, I think that's only a piece of shell. I don't think I that's... I think that's just a piece or yeah. running out of the rock. It doesn't look like... Gosh, so that, that's, that was holding up the bump there. That's, there's the bump. Ah. So is that in association? Ah, yeah. There's no line. Yeah, but maybe it's drifted off. A part of the outside of the shell that's drifted off. Yeah. And then leaves the, the zip bump in there. But there's definitely a bump there because that is at an angle, yeah, that little that prong. Prong. Um, not sure what to Go do. Go back now. to that. Ooh, my knee. That hurts. Right, here's a piece of wood in this one then. A bit of squid ink there, look. That's what we call it. Um, I'm going to go across the middle. Yeah, get a flat face. Two pieces, Two pieces of, wood. of wood. That's, that's what I've done. That's, that's what happened. Yeah. Two pieces of wood with Mike. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's what was mucking you're not, you're up. You're not mucking around with one. It's double, double edged. Oh, nice bit of uh, calcite ammonite protruding out with the white. Uh -huh. Just not splitting right. It's not, that, it's that back piece was split right, wasn't it? But... Yeah, it's because that double wood, isn't it? Yeah. No one home. Funny old bit. Ugh. Oh, nice. Oh, Look at that. that Absolute beauty there. That's more like That's it. That's more like it. Look at the colour of that. Lovely calcite ammonite. Put it on to uh... Yeah. Got him? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's a, that's a, um, Someone will flip that up. Yeah. 
wood you need. But um, with a little bit of wood there, and just running through there, that would look quite nice. Yeah, that's going to be a real pristine white one that. That's, just, that's the one to save. A bit of wood next to it. Yeah. And, and the zip at the top, that might be worth taking. Taking one as it is, yeah. just to trim that piece out there. Um, take it as it is with all that lovely wood in. One, two, three. Bits of wood, bits of wood. and then that your fingers at the top there with that nice white zip. Yeah. Yeah. yeah Here's Mike looking at the rain radar, seeing what's coming. All these. It's definitely coming, but it's all a matter of what time. Look, yeah, it started. Look, we're in it. Look. We're in it, are we yeah, already? That's come early because they said oh, no. two o'clock. There it is. There's the heavy stuff down there. Look. How far away? Well, it started now, so I can feel it. I forgot yeah, my leggings. Down, down in Cornwall. <laughs> oh no! The heavy stuff. Yeah, it's in Cornwall. Right. There's Mike, and he's done a bit more tapping on his uh, rock. Look at that. Absolute quality ammonites preserved in calcite, and one with a bit of. Uh, that's sort of natural coloration on the outside of the shell. The outside naked, do they call it? Yeah, that little bit there. All the colours of the rainbow there. Wow. Locked up in that. But that little bit there will flick off, won't it, next to that uh, Yeah, this piece here thing. will. If I can get my finger in there with these silly gloves on. There you go. Yeah. Is that more of it there? Revealed by the end of uh, Mike's nail. Fossil ammonite from the Jurassic age, an impression one side and the whole ammonite the other side. Wow. Well, it was good to be treated to that demonstration of fossil finding, and I've walked along the beach with my fossil walk and found this little stone with a lovely ammonite in it. So it proves you can just find small fragments on the beach. And here, my fossil walk lady has found a lovely backbone of an ichthyosaur. Well done, Georgina, a really special find. Well, I hope you enjoyed seeing Mike's fossil hunting skills he's developed over many, many years. He's got a huge skull in the Lyme Regis Museum that he saved from the destruction of the sea. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for other awesome fossil hunting videos. Thanks very much for watching.